Not all moneymakers in GTA Online require a ton of effort. There are several noob-friendly alternatives to consider for even the worst players out there. After all, money makes the world go round, and it's necessary to do anything enjoyable in this game. The 5 moneymakers listed below aren't the only ways for GTA Online players to make money. As far as rankings go, this list will start with some of the more inefficient methods before diving into better ways to earn cash in this game. 5 Simple Ways to Make Money in GTA Online Without Much Effort 5. Grind Easy Contact Missions Some contact missions are extremely easy to do. For example, Blow Up is a mission where players just destroy a few vehicles. It's tricky to fail something like that, and it's not the only example of an easy mission. The pay for these contact missions isn't as good as some of the upcoming entries on this list for the effort required, especially in weeks where there is no event bonus. Still, it's an option that applies to most low levels. 4. Go for weekly update bonuses. Most weekly updates have a monetary bonus that rewards GTA Online players for participating in a particular activity. It can be something simple like $250,000 for doing a sell mission for a specific business. Likewise, it could be something like $200,000 for winning a round of another particular job. These bonuses are usually only one-time things, but they're often easy to do and are worth the hassle. Thus, even the nobbyist casuals who don't play this game much can try them. As these bonuses update weekly, GTA Online players should check out Rockstar's Newswire articles every Thursday to find out the current news. 3. Bike Service The Criminal Enterprises added a new feature for clubhouses known as Bike Service. The player customizes a client's motorcycle and then delivers it to them. The whole process is easy for several reasons. The game tells you which customization options the client wants. No enemies will chase the player during delivery only. The things happening in the mission are customizing and delivering the bike. It's an easy way to make a $50,000 profit. If the player is lucky, the destination will be in Los Santos, meaning it's a good amount of money to earn for hardly any driving. 2. Passive Income from Nightclubs If a new player wanted a hassle-free way of making passive income, then owning a nightclub is a terrific decision. This business will give players up to $50,000 per in-game day. That means even those who largely AFK or goof around can earn a decent amount of money over time. Other passive income of note in GTA Online includes Agency, up to $20,000 daily, depending on the number of completed security contracts. Arcade, up to $5,000 daily, depending on the number of arcade machines placed. Clubhouse, $5,000 daily, but it requires the player to do bar resupply missions. The nightclub's hefty $50,000 stands out compared to the alternate methods. GTA Online players just need to consider keeping the popularity high, which is quickly done by completing one of Marcel's tasks or by swapping DJs. 1. Shark Cards The final method is for credit card warriors. It doesn't matter how good a player's skill is in a game if they can opt to purchase microtransactions to skip the grind. A similar train of thought applies here as one could always choose to buy shark cards to get however much money they need in GTA Online. It's very noob friendly, but it's worth mentioning that poorer players obviously can't take advantage of this method all that well. Nonetheless, it is technically an option to consider if one's skill level is too low to buy whatever in-game items they want. 